Hello, and welcome to an introduction on the operation of the Defender Filter, a regenerative media filtration system. This simulation demonstrates the actual steps for the complete operation of the Defender Filter. You will see how simply the Regenerative Media Filter, RMF, programmer functions with the automated features of the system. Media Charging be sure tank is completely drained before activating vacuum transfer. Confirm all valves are closed before start. Turn bump selector switch to bump set to prepare for vacuum transfer. Prepare appropriate amount of media for transfer. Open vacuum transfer valve. Open vacuum hose valve. Turn the vacuum transfer switch to on. Once you are done vacuuming in the media, turn the vacuum transfer switch to off. Close vacuum hose valve and vacuum transfer valve. Filling the system. Open the pre-coat line vent valve. Partially open vacuum drain valve. Turn bump selector switch to manual. Press cycle start to fill system. If your pump motor does not have a variable frequency drive, VFD, or a soft start motor, slowly open the pump throttling valve. The influent valve will open. When water comes out of the vacuum drain valve, close valve. When water comes out of the pre-coat line vent valve, close valve. The tank and piping should be full of water and all air vented out. Pre-coat mode. After 60 seconds, the pre-coat valve will open and the filter will pre-coat for a set time of 10 minutes. The filter will automatically go into filter mode after 10 minutes. Once in filter mode, the media charging is complete and will not be required again for another two to eight weeks depending on pool type and bather load. The pre-coat valve will close and the effluent valve will open. Regeneration mode, bumping. The filter should be bumped daily. If in manual mode, press bump start. If in auto mode, filter will perform bumping automatically. The bump cycle is manually or automatically performed every day. In the manual mode, the function requires one push of a button. When bump start is pressed, the recirculating pump will stop. The effluent valve and influent valve will close and the filter will bump 10 times. After bumping, the filter automatically will go into pre-coat mode. After pre-coat mode, the filter will go into filter mode and the pre-coat valve will close. The effluent valve will open. Discharging media. At some point, the media will need to be discharged. While the system is in filter mode, open the drain valve partially to clear any debris or clog and then close it slowly. To discharge media, press cycle stop. Turn bump selector switch to bump set. Bump the filter approximately 5 to 10 times by pressing Bump Start. The discharge process will take approximately 10 minutes for any size system. In most cases, the media is discharged directly to the sanitary sewer. Open Drain Valve Open Vacuum Drain Valve Flexible Tube Rinse once the tank is drained, close the drain valve. Important! Before pressing cycle start for rinse, turn vacuum transfer switch on for 1 to 2 seconds, then off. This will default the pre-coat valve to 60 seconds opening delay, preventing the water from draining out of the pre-coat line. Turn bump selector switch to manual. Refill the tank by pressing cycle start. When filling the system, watch as the water passes above the viewing window. Once it passes by, wait a few seconds, then go on to the next step. Once the tank is filled, 
press Cycle Stop. Turn Bump Selector Switch to Bump Set. Press Bump Start button 5 to 10 times. Open Drain Valve and completely drain tank. Cleaning the flexible tubes. Cleaning is recommended at least once a season. Follow the discharging media instruction prior to these steps. The programmed process of cleaning the tubes virtually eliminates the need to open the filter. Prepare appropriate amount of cleaner for transfer. Open vacuum transfer valve. Open vacuum hose valve. Close vacuum drain valve. Turn the vacuum transfer switch to on. Once you are done vacuuming in the cleaner, turn the vacuum transfer switch to off. Close vacuum hose valve and vacuum transfer valve. The filter will automatically bump 6 times every 15 minutes. Soak for at least 12 hours. Once done soaking, drain tank twice by following the rinse and drain process previously shown.